But the way w we would see it is that it gives the students an overall uh, perspective of the role of a human resource manager and also gives them a good grounding in business education and how that fits in, you know, how the human resource management role fits into an organisation, whether that be in the private sector or the public sector or the new economy or the old economy. Most business related subjects that, um, would tend to be applied science, so it's applied social sciences. It would be a requirement that we would uh, have people applying what, what they're doing in class and applying it to the real life world, the laboratory of work, so to speak, and to, to also reflect on what they're being taught in theory and how that's working out in practice. The guest lectures would, would have experience, a wealth of experience. The main thing would be that they would be accomplished and um, uh, would be able to give the students a very good insight into the particular industry, uh, sector, uh, line of work, line of business that they had uh, become accomplished in. So the students would get some good value out of that experience from the guest lecture. So by enriching the course from different perspectives, uh, different approaches, the students will get a better, um, uh, richer experience. The program is CIPD accredited, which gives the students a standard or a license to practice human resource management. So that's something they leave with, which a lot of businesses, managers, industry people require. Historically, we do have a better student lecturer ratio which means that the lecturer can give more attention. Students now are a bit more cognizant and more mindful that what is at the end invariably means employment, career, job. I guess that's the popularity of the course is that we're, we're able to deliver in that area.